Welcome to Art Smart OC on Real Orange. I'm Mindy Stearns. Now, the Philharmonic Society of Orange County has presented an exciting season-long festival exploring the diversity of Japanese and Japanese-American arts and culture called Jap Japan Olds OC. And one of the more exciting events of this season's festival is the celebration of one of the most sought-after conductors in the world, maestro Gustavo Dudamel. Now, joining me today is the Philharmonic's artistic administrator, Jeffrey Mystery, to tell us about Celebration Gustavo, really the anchor of the whole festival of the season. It's a very exciting get for us here in Orange County, isn't it? Let's talk about Gustavo and what he's bringing to the festival. Well, thanks. well thank you very much for having me yes. here. Um, Gustavo Dudamel, that's certainly a name that is now synonymous with, with some of the, the pinnacles of classical music. He can, is a definite box office draw. He can, he can sell out a house like it's nothing. The is. likes of, there he is with, with all that flamboyant hair. Sell out a house just like Yo-Yo Ma can, just like uh, Renee Fleming can, just like Itzhak Perlman can. And it's a, a wonderful, the situation that we get to have him here here with his band. He's the, the new music director, as you mentioned, and the fact that he's bringing his ensemble here is just absolutely amazing that we can include it in the Japan OC Festival is even more compelling to our audience. It's exciting because it's really this new partnership with Carnegie Hall has really like been a really strong partnership, and they're doing the same festival back in New York, but we're really, I think we got the big get out here in Orange <laughs> County. I mean, he's, I mean, he's been featured as one of the most, 100 most fascinating people from Time Magazine, he's been on 60 Minutes a few times. I mean, he's he's energetic and he's just intoxicating to watch. Absolutely, I, I have friends that are in the orchestra as well, and then friends that are administrators there, and they're just so so thrilled to be working with him. And the mm -hmm. fact that they get to have someone that just instantly came onto the world scene, and then all of a sudden is it brings his outstanding charisma and his his sensational qualities and and his educational aspirations to the city at large, not just uh, L.A., but he's also spreading down here to Orange County. What's exciting? So he's born in Venezuela, and he has had a very good um, career in Venezuela, and has come like about 15 years. He's been conducting route, right? Is that about? He started off very young, and then mm -hmm. uh, he won the Mahler competition in 2005, and big instantly deal. he was very, very young. He's he's 30 years old, and look at he's all the 30. accolades oh, that he has. Oh my goodness! It's, it's 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 tremendous what he's able to get in a short time. This is his, his second season now with the Los Angeles Philharmonic, and and with that, uh, the 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 concert that he's bringing to us, it, it is as we mentioned part of the Japan OC mm -hmm. Festival. It will include a piece by Toro. Takamitsu, uh, entitled The Requiem uh, mm -hmm. for, for Strings, which is about a 10-minute piece, mm -hmm. uh, a, a very interesting piece uh, that is written uh, very much 20, 20th century, and it's great that we're able to, to bring that to our Orange County audience. What I love about the uh, Celebration Gustavo event, it's on March 5th and uh, in the afternoon at 2.30, and you can still get tickets. Um, visit www.philharmonicsociety.org to get tickets, but um, part of this event, there's a concert and then there's a really incredible like red carpet event to go have dinner with the maestro and for 200 or so and part of the evening there's some live auction which supports the uh, music mobile, is that right? That yes. goes out and serves the community locally and really is giving instruments to children. Tell us a little bit about that because I know Gustavo did a lot of that himself in his home country and right. is very passionate about. Well one of the one of the uh, auction items will be uh, the opportunity to be able to contribute some mon uh, money that will and funds that will go towards educational outreach program. Uh, the one in, that we will be auctioning is called Music Mobile. It's an actual van, brand new van, uh, that was uh, purchased by uh, with the money that we were able to get last year mm -hmm. at the at last year's gala. Um, essentially, it is filled with instruments, and some of our volunteers will drive down to local area schools in Orange County, and they will physically put in the kids' hands some instruments, which is great because you have many times that the uh, children may not have played any kind of instrument at all, and who knows, it could blossom into something else, just like Gustavo Dudamel was handed a Violin, and then suddenly here he is, the music director of the Philharmonic. The music director of the Philharmonic. Now this this the evening event. is very exciting. You can you can do both. I think. I mean, I love that there is just so much um, emphasis for the community and outreach too. I think with the arts. I mean, we just have to keep them alive, and we have to keep promoting them. And to get someone youthful like Gustavo is a very very exciting get. So. Right. The 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 event is is uh, it is chaired by Marsha Anderson. And yes, and uh, Angel of the Art, and a friend of ours. And there's a lot of members on the community, and I don't mean to cut you off. Mm -hmm. But I, I just want to make sure that people know they can get tickets by going to the philharmonicsociety.org. Join us on March 5th. It's going to be an incredible evening and a young, world-renowned conductor. It's a treat. You don't want to miss it. That's a wrap on Art Smart OC. And whenever you're looking for information on arts and culture events happening in OC, you can find it on sparkoc.com. All right. Thank you very much, Mindy. We're right back.